wokeness. We're told that we need to embrace it. We need to be enlightened with wokeness. But what if there was something dark behind it? Something dark and ancient. A mystery as old as the pagan gods of the pagan world. This is Jonathan Kahn. The Return of the Gods is the latest book with a revelation that the ancient spirits, principalities of the ancient world are returning to the modern world, to America, to the West and to the rest of the world. We are undergoing, I'm going to give you a little taste of this. We're undergoing a metamorphosis, a metamorphosis of paganization. The gospel, the word of God, the faith of God is being removed. But when we turn away from God, the only thing left, the only alternative is paganism, not neutrality, not even secularism. And so we've watched as these changes in values, the, the, a new morality for an old morality or, or, or a traditional, what we've known is being overturned with something we've never known. And what, what is being presented as progressive and enlightened is actually pagan. We don't even realize it. Let me give you a glimpse of this in ways this has taken over where you didn't even realize it. When, when you have monotheism, you have one God, one truth. When you have paganism, you have polytheism, many gods or many truths. So therefore, with monotheism, you have one truth, you have objectivity. With paganism, you have many truths, or which means no truth because one is saying this is true, one is saying it's not true. Everyone has their own authentic truth. Look at this, how this spirit has come into America and into the world. And it, notice how it's happened. This spirit is a spirit of paganism, but it's replaced a spirit of God. In this spirit, with this spirit, everybody has their own authentic truth, which is no truth. Um, if a man says he's a cat, then the man has to be revered as a cat because that's his authentic truth. There's really no truth. If a woman says she's not a she, she's a they, well then now she's not a she, she has to be a they because they is her authentic truth or they is they's authentic truth. If a boy says he's a tree, he is now not a boy anymore, he's a tree. Everybody has their authentic truth. Everything is true, which means nothing is true. But when you have one God, you have one truth. Messiah, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. The Bible says there is one God, there is one truth, there is one way, there is one salvation, and it's open to all. But this is where we have been. Wokeism is actually paganism revived with a mask for the modern world. This is a little taste of the revelation, what's revealed in the mystery of the return of the gods. And this is the latest book I've written which reveals this in detail. We're giving you a taste of it. And this is what we're going to be revealing next. Another modern phenomenon behind which lies the ancient gods. Next time, it's going to be the rise of the animal men. That's right. Hit subscribe so you don't miss it. This is Jonathan Kahn. I'll see you next time with the animal men.